If you read the words of Tachanun, Yagasi Ba'anchasi, my groans, my tears filled my bedding. David HaMelech bemoaned the fact that he failed the biggest Nisoyen of his life. He said to Hashem, test me. He knew that potentially he could be on the level of the Avos, and Hashem said, I'm going to test you. And in front of Amva Eida, David HaMelech failed the test, the biggest test of his life. David HaMelech lived with Bacheva and Eishas Ish. Okay, Chazal tell us it wasn't as bad as we think. I'm afraid she was divorced, but at the end of the day, he failed the biggest Nisoyen of his life, and for the rest of his life, he suffered the embarrassment, the pain, and the understanding that he failed. And he recognized that everyone knew it. And here's the question I'd like to ask you. What bridge did David HaMelech jump off of? Right? I mean, forget it. Mashiach, Zikainu, anointed of Hashem. It's all over. No more. It's all over. Which bridge did he jump off of? And the answer is David HaMelech did not jump off any bridge. David HaMelech did that very difficult thing that we human beings have a lot of trouble doing. He looked in the mirror and he said these words, I failed. I failed, but that doesn't mean I'm a failure. I failed this Nisoyen. I messed up. I blew it. But that doesn't mean I'm a failure. I have many successes, many things I've accomplished. This thing was wrong. This thing I did was a failure, but I as a human being, I as a person, I as an Eved Hashem am not a failure. And that distinction, recognizing that I made a mistake, I did something wrong, but that doesn't make me a failure, is one of the most critical concepts that a person needs to have. Because I guarantee, if you set your goals high in life, you will fail. You'll fail many, many times, many, many has shown us an ability to recognize that, yes, I failed. Yes, I messed up, doesn't make me a failure, is one of the keys to success in all endeavors in life. And especially when a person puts his goal as to really grow, to really become Kaddish, that understanding that I will fail because it's part of the nature of this Nisoyen. And yet I'm going to pick myself up, get back in that fight, and recognize that I failed doesn't mean I'm a failure, is one of the biggest yesodos that a person has to have to properly succeed.